everyone, I'm Mickey Mar here and I'm giving you my recap for the past two weeks. I skipped a week last week, um, got kind of busy. Um, I don't know if you can tell, but I don't know who or what gave me the sniffles, but I've kind of been fighting that also. But in my last video, I was talking about how I was given um, a five pound goal weight and and I was pretty excited about it. Like, I was doing a dance at the gym. She gave me another four pound goal. And I'm a little bit scared this week of not reaching that goal. Um, I had a friend visit last week. We went to Cracker Barrel and I kind of ate a little bit crazy. Um, last night I had a margarita. But I've been working out really hard and then tonight I have an event. And so I, this morning, it was really, cool like even for Florida it was nice this morning so <clears throat> I walked four miles so hopefully that'll help out with anything that I plan on drinking or eating later on this evening um hope to be good I mean my meals I ate some wheat bread and a banana so far today so I'm trying to keep my calories low to <clears throat> make up for what I may possibly eat later on there's supposed to be a bunch of vendors so and it's a costume contest thing going on. Maybe I'll take a video while I'm out there and show you guys. But um, yeah, with the four pound goal weight, my freaking weight's not going down at all. Um, and I gotta keep reminding myself, be consistent, stay consistent because when you're consistent, that's when things surprise you. That's when the scale does surprise you. And as long as you stay faithful to the diet and faithful to your workouts. So like I said, <clears throat> You can't do one without the other. I've been working my butt off like crazy, but you, you gotta do the whole diet thing. Like that really does come in hand. Like they say that the diet's 90% and, and working out is 10. I think it's a little bit less than that. Like work out, you do have to do something to build muscle and, and burn and get that metabolism going. But, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna have to like, I, say, I feel like I say this every two weeks. I'm gonna, drink my green juice, which I do, like I'll, I'm on lunch breaks, I will drink a green juice every now and then and sip on that for a couple of hours. And that really does help. And I do feel more energy when I do drink the green smoothies. So maybe one day I'll, I'll do a video for that as well. I've tweaked a few recipes and I'm, I, do, I, I do what works for me and what I like. Certain, certain um, fruits and veggies that people like to put in their smoothies, just not for me. And so I just, I'm not gonna waste my food or my money or my time making something that's gonna be thrown away in the trash or down the sink. So, but <clears throat> according to this morning, in order to meet my four pound goal weight, I have to lose five pounds by Saturday. And I didn't take any days off. I don't plan on taking any days off from work this week. So maybe um, I'll walk extra. I've noticed I've been getting a little bit more tired lately. I, it could be because of me being sick, but I wasn't able to take a nap yesterday. And usually I could take a nap on Saturdays because I wake up at 4.15 on Saturday mornings to make it to the gym at six. And by the time I'm done with doing our stadium workout and doing maybe boxing class, when I come home, I'll take care of the dog, I'll walk her and take a shower and nap for a couple hours. And for some reason I was not able to, my body was not able to wind down yesterday. So, um, but yeah, things have been going well. We got a couple more weeks left to challenge. I'm super excited for it to be over with. And they've already announced that the gym after challenge is over, if we want to enroll in this kind of boot camp, this abs and butt thing going on. So that'll last for three weeks. And I think I will do it on top of my regular boxing classes because of, um, I don't want to get complacent. And I do want to have that whole muscle confusion thing going on. They also will have an award ceremony for um, the 12 week, week, week challenge. And that usually occurs maybe two weeks after the final weigh in. And I want to take those extra classes to maintain what I've already started and worked for. Um, yeah, I just don't want to get an award or a medal or something and people look at me like, that girl blew up. Like, what what happened? Like, we already see her on an after photo and two weeks later she's already had too much fun. So, um, yeah, I, I really want to keep the momentum going. 
keep things moving. Um, it is getting hotter outside, so as far as like working out outside, oh my God, please. But I will go to the gym and um, I have no choice but to walk the dog. And so that does make me break the sweat, and which in turn helps out because at my gym, they don't have a sauna. So that kind of helps out with the, the sweat factor. Me mowing the yard like that really helps me too. So I do plan on doing that also this week mowing the yard with the sweat belly band thing that I showed you guys a few weeks ago. And um, so hopefully a pound or two will be soaked in my clothes and when it's time for me to weigh in, um, it'll be gone. I'll, I'll make weight. So yeah, trials and tribulations. So hope everybody's doing well. Thanks for watching. And um, I'll be more consistent and maybe go in a couple of videos here and there. So hope everybody has a great day and stay blessed. Bye.